Hey guys, this is going to be a quick smashed potato video. These are the quickest potatoes that you're ever going to make. So I have some golden potatoes right here. Now, what I have done thus far is I've already peeled them, boiled them, and they're hot. And they're the, the yellow ones. You can use the red. You can use any potatoes you want, but I like the golden, okay? And I put a little bit of bouillon, like two bouillon cubes in there just to give it a little bit of flavor already. When you use your mixer, it goes really fast. So I'm gonna put some seasoning in here. This right here, this is just some seasoning salt. And, and be mindful of your seasoning since you if, if you're gonna use the uh, chicken base or the bouillon cubes, cause it already kind of seasons it. And this is some Uncle Chris's seasoning. So any of your all purpose seasoning will work fine. And right here, I just have some black pepper. Now. If you don't want black pepper, you can use white. A lot of people don't like the black specks in their potatoes. I don't mind. It doesn't bother me at all because I put all kind of other seasons in there also. Now, in this bowl right here, I have just eight ounces of cream cheese and one stick of butter. And I cubed it. Let me see if I can find a spoon or a spatula. Okay, here you go. I just cubed it. Um, and then because it's just going to make it melt quick quicker and so I just throw that in there and like I said those potatoes are hot I just boiled them you only need to boil them for about 20 25 minutes in there and they come out um very soft fork tender that's what we say fork tender put your attachment on like that now right here you can use milk or half and half I have cream cream gives it a um a richness so I'm gonna just pour like a half a cup of cream to start to see what I need. And if you hear something in the background, that's my husband on the phone talking to his family. You see how quick this goes? I mean, I use my mixers for everything. I mean, I grate chicken with them. You know how you have to shred your chicken or your pork? I just throw them right in the mixer. See how quick this is? Instead of sitting there mashing them, throw a little bit more cream in there. Actually, let me get this whole cup. So basically, I did about um, about eight, eight, eight or nine uh, medium potatoes, some seasoning, some cream, eight ounces of cream cheese, stick of butter, pepper, and you got mashed potatoes. So let me plate this up so you guys can see what it's looking like and give it a taste for you guys. Actually, before I plate it up, I want to add a little bit of this. This is this new seasoning I found and it's the Kinder's rub it's like a rub for meats and stuff I actually for my turkey breast that I'm making I put that on there but I put this on um, some vegetables the other day and it was delicious so I'm gonna add just a little bit of that because it got a buttery seasoned flavor to it so now I'm gonna plate up and let you guys see okay this is what the potatoes look like Gonna show you guys how creamy they are. Look at that. Let me taste them for you. And you can put gravy on them, or you can just eat them just like this. They're delicious, just like this. These are so good. We're having them with our um, Thanksgiving meal. So we're gonna put some giblet gravy on it. But like I said, you can have these any day of the week. And you see that took all of what? Three, four minutes to do, if that. The, you know, the boiling potatoes takes about 20 minutes, but other than that, once you put it together, it goes very quick in this mixer. All right. You guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. You guys have a great day.